Hey nerds, I've got a fun one for you today. I'm going to be talking about zone entry stats, which are rising up the charts faster than EDM artists with foreign objects on their heads in defensive player evaluation. These stats apply on offense as well, but are used more widely as a metric of defensive skill. Note that this video is not about zone starts, which track what side of the ice a player typically begins their shift on. The term zone entry refers to whether the puck enters the defensive zone on an opposing player's stick or as a result of a dump-in. Finesse forwards will have a higher tendency to carry the puck into their offensive zone versus a fourth liner with the puck skills of a brick who you usually see dumping in. In my opinion, there are two zone entry stats that are the most critical. The first is carry-in percentage which is the success rate teams have at entering the offensive zone with the puck in a player's control. For a defensive player, the stat becomes carry-in percentage against for the amount of time that they are on the ice. A true D-zone border ruffian can hold the opponent to a carry-in percentage of about 60%, but that number can be up to almost 80% for a turnstile on skates. The other zone entry stat, which is really useful, is scoring chances allowed from both dump-ins and carry-ins. This is essentially the next logical step after carry-in percentage, comparing how effectively the puck can be defended based on how it entered the zone. There's no fancy formulas for this stat, but generally dump and chase is half as efficient or less at generating scoring chances than carry-ins. As a result, a defender who forces more dumps than Taco Bell is doing a significantly better job at goal prevention. So why do zone entry stats matter? If a player can prevent carry-ins on defense, they can turn their D-zone into the Bermuda Triangle where forwards will be lost at sea, goals will disappear into the abyss, and goalies will love them for it. Anyway, if you've made it this far, thank you for watching. I'm the Armchair Analyst, and have a great day.